Hey, it's Jake over at Heartland Marine. I'm gonna do a quick walk around video on this R5. Kind of point out any little flaws, anything I see, kind of let you know exactly what you're looking at. Starting here in the bow. All this is just a little road grime. Got a little bit of scuff here, but that's peeling off, so no issues there. Keel looks nice. Check out the port side. It's a little dirty, so you'll see some water spots and whatnot, but I'll try to point out any scratches or little nicks I see. So far, everything looks pretty good. A little bit of dirt. Got a few little nicks back here. Not real deep, but those aren't into the fiberglass, so typically we'll just leave those alone. <clears throat> Excuse me, let's check the drive. Got some, I don't know what that is, a grease or something. We'll get that cleaned up. Drive looks good. Skeg's nice, props are good. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, we just got some spider stuff. So other than these three little chips, Of course, I just smeared some black grease in there, but three little chips there. Port side looks really nice. Sea deck we're gonna get replaced. It's starting to curl up. So we'll get a new sea deck for the uh, swim platform here. While I'm up here, let's just go ahead and do the inside. <clears throat> I got one. Well, I thought it was a tear. It looks like it might just be a leaf. Yeah. So, scratch that. And we need to go through and do a full detail on this thing. Seems on that seat look good. No issues with the back seat. So far, everything on the inside looks beautiful. Got a few marks here, those will clean up. Yeah, no rips or tears yet. Everything looks really nice. <clears throat> Dash is beautiful. Okay. 
head compartment. Got the porta potty. Doesn't look like that was used much at all. Got the bow seats here with the uh, fold down armrests. And being the WSS, it does have the wakeboard tower with the tower speakers. I'm not seeing any tears in the bimini. Everything looks pretty solid. It needs to be power washed, got some spider residue and whatnot, but overall it looks pretty nice. And this one does have the fold down swim step. So this here will fold down into the water. And I forgot to mention on the tower, it does have the uh, board racks. Let's hop down here, take a look at the starboard side. So I've got a couple minor, and I mean very minor little scratches. Got one here, and the one here. And those might even buff out. I can't feel those with a fingernail. Let's try to get a better angle here. Couple minor scratches on this side. Again, I can't even feel those with the fingernail. I think they're showing up a little more on camera than they do in person. A few more here. And with, with the buffing, I think a lot of those will lighten up. Very, very minor though. Yeah, overall for being a 15. Actually, I think this is a 15. Let me just double check here. We've had a couple of the WSSs over the last couple weeks. Let me just make sure it's a 15. Actually, this is a 16. So, for being a 16, though, it's about as nice as you'd expect. Yeah, beautiful boat. So this is Jake over at Heartland Marine. If you have any questions, give me a call at 816-394-8850. Thanks.